I do, just do white cloud and that'll give me an idea. Okay, do do Detroit. Um, what's the rate on it? Might as well do it. Go right there. Yeah, let's just go ahead and do it. Okay, talk to you later. Alright, bye. Ohio at the TA truck stop. We loaded our dumpsters yesterday. Bailey's up in the truck. A little noisy out here. Ah, uh, this is what we got. They're real easy to load. It's probably about 20,000 pounds, somewhere like that. Going down to Cincinnati. Now, we're lucky. They're going on, uh, what, I think it's 275 that goes around Cincinnati. They're going around the outside of Cincinnati, so we, uh, we don't have to get way down into Cincinnati. The only thing that I do that I don't see most guys do with these is I'll put a chain on the front up here. Just put one chain on the front, and that's more so to, if I should hit the brakes, keep them from shooting forward. But uh, other than that, these are pretty cut and dry. Uh, today, it's going to be a busy day. we got to go deliver these, run over to uh, Brookville, Indiana, pick up heavy roofing shingles, and take them down to uh, Norman, Norman, Oklahoma, uh, over by Oklahoma City. So uh, hopefully... Peterbilt tanker. Hopefully we'll make it over to Effingham at least and maybe a little bit further. So, all right, let's get our day started. All right, we uh, loaded our roofing shingles and uh, we're stopped here at the rest area. We've only gone about 20 miles. Uh, Google Maps, it's I-74 out there. Google Maps said there's about an hour backup on I-74 before you get to Indianapolis. 
So I don't know what I'm going to do. We do have an option. So Google Maps gives the option of running over to 65, run through the woods over to 65, down to Louisville, and down that way. I was going to go outside, but you can see the guys mowing the grass. So it'll be kind of noisy out there. But if you look in the mirror, you'll see our roof, roofing shingles. Bailey's excited. i take her out. We're heavy. Paperwork says 47,640 pounds. So if you look right there, if it shows up, let me see if I can get it to show up. So if you look, we're sitting at about 30, 33,000 on the drives. So I had to move it back. I was going to show you guys that when I go outside. I had to move it back from center just a little bit throw some weight to the back of the trailer all right let me figure out what we're going to do here we might run through the woods go down to louisville all right so i have decided Continue on State Road 46 East for one and a half miles. To run through the woods. And when I say run through the woods, I just mean not on the interstate. We're going to get on Highway 129. I don't think I've ever took this road, so I hope it works out. We'll take Highway 129 down to 50, Highway 50. Take 50 over to uh, Mount Vernon, Indiana. Get on 65. Run 65 down towards Louisville. Go get on 64. Google Maps updated their uh, thing and it said there's a 30 minute backup. It keeps fluctuating between 30 and 20 minutes, so. I don't know if it's construction or accident, or both. People uh, get too much of a hurry. But we'll drag our heavy roofing shingles the woods. See that sign that says Hill Rom? I think they make uh, medical stuff. I think so. I don't know. Onto Indiana 129 South. We'll see. We'll see. Okay. 
Continue on Indiana 129 south for 10 miles. Oh, man. Rough. made it over here to Cuba, Missouri. Um, so I ended up running through the woods there over to uh, I-65. And then uh, 65 down to Louisville to 64. And I ran 64 all the way to St. Louis. And we're now on 44. This is the, uh, I think this is called the uh, Midwestern truck stop or something. Anyway, I like stopping here. I usually don't park on this end. I used to park way down at the other end, but uh, I didn't see any parking down there I liked. So we're gonna park here. Plus they got a nice, nice big green field here. Bailey's out running around. she has been cooped up. We had a long day today. We drove uh, 560 miles today unloaded and reloaded so uh, we got about 400 miles down to uh, Oklahoma City we did book a load out of Oklahoma City loading on Friday going back up to Michigan so that's our weekend load so we're set for a while all right I'll give you one more view of the truck here and we're gonna call it quits for today all right talk to you later thanks for watching